Hi Cancer, this is Tracy from Northeast Tarot and welcome to your weekly tarot forecast for the week of December 16th through the 22nd. This is for Cancer Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. So Cancer, for this reading, I am using the Shadowscapes Tarot deck along with the Magical Times Empowerment cards. All right, so at the bottom of the deck, Cancer, I do have the Strength card. So the sign of Leo could be significant. Let's see here. All right, so we have Strength. We have the Eight of Wands. Okay, we have, we have the World. We have the Knight of Cups underneath the World. So for some of you, there's an offer, there's a proposal coming in with the Knight of Cups. This could be an opportunity to travel with the Eight of Wands and the world. Uh, we do have, you know, Christmas coming up here, so I could be reading for some cancers. Maybe you're physically traveling. Maybe this is long distance travel for some of you. You could be moving house or maybe you're just traveling to be with friends, family at this time. You could be traveling to be with a Leo. Uh, a Leo could be significant for some of you. This could be a love interest with the with the Knight of Cups, or maybe you're being invited. Maybe someone is inviting you uh, somewhere this week. I could be reading for some Cancers. Maybe you're in a long distance relationship. Um, but strength represents that inner that inner strength. Being patient, staying calm handling a situation um, in a compassionate, graceful way. Uh, the overall energy is the Three of Cups. So there could be something going on with a friend or something socially with the Three of Cups. Maybe you have to be patient with a friend or for some of you maybe like extra compassionate with a friend. Some of you might be traveling to be with a friend at this time this week. Uh, maybe you're going to spend the holidays with a friend. The Three of Cups can speak about reunions. So this could be you reuniting with like an old friend. It can be an ex, but it, it doesn't have to be. For some of you Cancers, I absolutely see physical travel coming up. Um, and so... Yeah, some of you, are, you're going to be traveling to maybe spend the holidays with someone. Uh, I definitely see physical travel. Others, you could be traveling for work. We have the Knight of Pentacles here. We have the Four of Pentacles. But I also have the Ace of Cups. And so for some of you, this is like a new job opportunity. Um, if you're landing a new job... Maybe you have to move. Others, you might have to travel for work here this week. But this could be a dream job. So those of you that are landing a new job, maybe this is like a dream job. It's going to bring you great happiness. Um, some of you with the Three of Cups, you could be going out and celebrating. Celebrating this, this new job, this financial opportunity. But I definitely see new beginnings here. I see new beginnings. You have aces here in this spread. We have the five of pentacles here. So maybe some of you prior cancer, um, something was lacking with the five of pentacles. So maybe prior you were working a job, you've been working a job where maybe you felt underpaid or you didn't feel financially secure we have the five mirroring the four here and so some of you you're cutting this you're cutting this position you are going to maybe accept this this opportunity even if you have to move it's a better opportunity you're going to feel financially secure and maybe your friends or your social circle a friend might have helped you land this job for some of you I see you actually cutting this out of your life. This is this is success. Um, you've been struggling, but the Ace of Swords here, this is success. This is success. 
maybe you dealt with like a lot of adversity or a lot of challenges on the job front it's affected you financially i see you physically traveling for some of you landing a new job others you're just moving away from this you're moving away from this this is success this is victory with you overcoming some struggles some difficulties and I see some of you landing a new job. That could be thanks to a friend who maybe has helped you. That could be a Leo. That could also be a Libra, an Aquarius, or a Gemini. We have the Queen of Swords here. And if you're a Cancer where you felt like something was unfair... You know, maybe you felt overworked, underpaid. Something wasn't fair. I think that, you know, you've kept your eye on the prize. You've had to be incredibly strong, incredibly patient with this situation. But we see forward movement. And I could be reading for some cancers where you're signing something this week. If you're landing a new job, you could be signing something. Maybe you're simply finishing up where you were working prior. You're just kind of tying up loose ends. But we see you as you go into 2020 here. We see you. Um, you, have, you have blessings. You have new beginnings that you are manifesting here. Ace of Cups. Ace of Swords. Knight of Wands, enthusiastic, passionate, excited, charging forward. Nine of Wands with strength at the bottom of the deck. This is you persevering, that perseverance paying off. You relying upon that inner strength here at this time to manifest these new beginnings. Leaving this behind. I feel like some of you were struggling. You had to be incredibly strong. Um, but again, that perseverance is paying off. This is victory. And we see you moving forward. Some of you here this week, you're celebrating. You have these blessings coming in here. And those of you that you're landing a new job, this is going to be a really good position. You might really actually enjoy the work that you're doing, but you are going to feel more financially secure. With this new position, this new company, um, you can grow and you can move up and you can, and there's going to be raises and bonuses and you're going to feel financially just more secure. And so this is very positive. This is very positive. Let's pull you an additional guidance card, Cancer. Some of you still have to be patient. This is just a weekly a weekly forecast, but it is a time to get excited. Events could be kind of taking place um, slowly, but you're making progress, and I, I feel like by the time we start 2020, you're manifesting these, these new beginnings. Yeah. Wow. Dreamer, your dreams have chosen you. Find fulfillment fulfillment in pursuing your destiny this is the magic of life wow so dream big dream big cancer because you're manifesting you are one of the signs um there are a few but you're one of the signs that i mean right at the start of the year this new year this new decade you're manifesting if you have new beginnings change you are transforming let go of the past embrace the light and joy of this new day it's a new day this is beautiful. And I never actually see these two cards come out together. So this is beautiful. So it's like dream big. Dream big. Don't give up. Some of you, maybe you have to kind of step into that, into your power here with strength and be strong and just kind of decide to kind of jump in the driver's seat and go. But you're going to do that. You're transforming. So embrace this, this opportunity because you do have opportunities. All right, Cancer, so I hope that you found this reading 
helpful. If you are not subscribed to my channel, please do subscribe. If you are interested in having a private reading, please check out northeasttarot.com. Have a great week, guys.